reigning MVP, Aaron Rodgers is returning to the Green Bay Packers after a drama-filled past year and speculation about Rodgers demanding a trade or retiring. Neither will happen. The sides are working on an extension to his contract, which was set to expire next season. The Packers soon after replaced the franchise tag on star-wide receiver Devontae Adams. The question remains, what will happen to Jordan Love, the 2020 first-round pick who was selected to presumably replace Rodgers? Baseball is back. After a 99-day lockout, the MLB Players Association voted 26-12 to to accept the owner's most recent offer. Even better, there will be a full season with the season starting on April 7th with nine inning doubleheaders and the end date being moved back three days, making up for the delay. Significant parts of the deal include changes to core economics, postseason being expanded to 12 teams, the universal designated hitter, and advertisements on uniforms. Free agency has begun with a flurry of moves being expected on big names such as Carlos Correa and Freddie Freeman. Spring training camps will open on Sunday. One of the teams rumored to be interested in Rodgers was the Denver Broncos, who soon after the Rodgers news traded for Seattle Seahawks QB Russell Wilson. The Seahawks received a package of draft picks and players in exchange for the nine-time Pro Bowler, including two first-round picks, QB Drew Locke and tight end Noah Fant. The Broncos hope they have finally found their QB to lead the team to the playoffs after having 11 different starters since 2016. The Seahawks team to be rebuilding after releasing eight-time Pro Bowler Bobby Wagner. Now let's take a look at games to watch. Tomorrow at 8.30 p.m. there will be three-pointers and dunks galore when the Milwaukee Bucks and Golden State Warriors face off. Giannis Antetokounmpo recorded a triple-double in their first matchup, which was won handily by the Bucks. The Players' Championship is underway and will go through Sunday. The winner will get $20 million, which is more than any other golf tournament. Justin Thomas is the defending champion. The second round is happening now. Now, let's head back over to the desk.